Hello and welcome back to our YouTube channel Excel Bus Testing where you will learn in easy simple way. Our today's topic is how to test e-commerce applications. In today's video we are going to share some of the important test scenarios apart from your normal test scenarios and even which type of testing is important while doing e-commerce application. So let's get started. What are e-commerce applications? E-commerce or electronic commerce is a type of trading of goods and services on the internet. An e-commerce website is your digital storefront of the internet. It facilitates the transaction between buyer and sellers. It is a virtual space where you showcase your product and your online customer make their selections. Your website acts as a product shelf, sales staff and cash register of your online business channels. So let's see which types of testing is essential while doing the e-commerce testing. So that will be functional testing, usability testing, security testing, performance testing, database testing, mobile application testing and alpha or beta testing. Let's see few test scenarios of all the pages of e-commerce applications. So first of all general test cases. The general test cases you write for the typical functions within e-commerce website. It could include the movement of users as well as the filters on the particular page. It could also be the loading of category pages. The idea is to check the interaction and evaluate the overall experience of the user will have when going through the website. Even below are few the few test cases you can go through. First of all image checks which will help identify the quality visibility as well as the relevance of the image within the page content filtering option to verify if they are working in addition it will ensure that it will help them to identify a specific set of products whenever the user checks of particular option navigation navigation through the website should be comfortable and frictionless you should also check if the pages and the products are relevant to each other or not then second most important topic is home page test cases the home page is very important to impress the user with its design in e-commerce the home page act as your guide and salesman it is the page through which the user tends to move to the another category and product pages the robustness of this page becomes very essential it be, uh, as it makes or breaks the customer so few scenarios i'll be sharing if there is a scroll on website or clickable image check if it is working or not if the scroll is automatic check the interval between scrolls and evaluate the efficiency will the mouse over leads to another image will the will the click takes user to the relevant page and product or not then check for if the user navigates from home page can they move to another part of the website without friction are the clickable text and images are working on websites or not search test cases customer rely on the search function to find the products category or brand on the e-commerce website it is the most commonly used feature in the e-commerce so therefore it is essential to check and verify that the function works properly let's see few scenarios is it mention how the user could search are all the search possibilities functioning correctly if you have claimed that the user can search using brand name check if it is working and relieve the relevant information can you filter your search results for different options such as brand reviews rating and others can you navigate between search result pages on the website if the search bar is located on the website ensure that the user can search from the home page if you are allowing user to search from internal pages make sure to test that feature as well next one is recommended products e-commerce have one of the most important feature is recommended products page it is based on the past purchases and the most bought products for the recent searches these recommendations are also shown after the user has purchased the particular products so few scenarios could be assess if the recommendations are in sync with the search made by the user again you need to study the analytics to identify if the recommendations will be interest of the user or not and the once the customer has completed the purchase your website should immediately showcase the recommended products make sure this feature works 
Next one is most important payment page. Have you ever turned away from the website because the transaction was unsuccessful? Many visitors have moved to another site that offers immediate and secure transactions. Abundant at checkout is one of the primary reasons why you should assess your payment page. So these few scenarios has to be tested. Test if all the payment modes are mentioned on your website is working. Assess the checkout option and check if the user will experience any waiting time while checking out. Are there any specific sign in requirements for the returning customer? How safe is the transaction? For example, does the website take the customer to secure page when asking them to enter the card details? How does the user returns to the website once the payment has been accepted? Validate the flow of the checkout page and interaction at various points. It would help to write a test case that will evaluate all the payment aspects from start to finish. Next one is shopping cart. On average, the cart abandonment rate across the industries is about 70%. To avoid losing customer after loading the cart, you should invest in the test cases to gauge your shopping cart. So few scenarios could be, have you ever allowed the user to edit the shopping cart? For example, they can add or delete the item at the checkout. Are the users able to add coupon codes, vouchers or gift coupon at the checkout? Are the taxes are applicable as per the location of the user? Does the system calculate the shipping cost correctly for the area? Can the user add item after viewing the cart? So these scenarios are important. Next one is product details page. The product pages should be articulate to interact with the users and convert them as a customer. The product page will need to perform salesperson's jobs by giving away all the relevant information about the product. The information should include details, uses, specification, properties, prices and product images. It would help if you correctly place everything on the page. Test for the following to validate these pages. Are the photos used are high quality and adequately define all these pages? Are there reviews on the page? Has the page mentioned the delivery and shipping related information? If the product is out of stock, has it been said to the website? Does the page include all the specifications? And last but not the least, post-order test cases. Things need to work smoothly even after the order has been placed. So check if the user can cancel their order after placing it. Check if the customer can view order details page on the website. Can they view the history of their purchases on the website? Can customer is able to view the invoices of the old purchases? Apart from this, contacts us, FAQ and information, other information pages are also important to check out. So this is it for today. If you like this video, please hit the like button and share it to your friends and family. Subscribe to our channels to get updated videos. We post videos on every Tuesday and Friday. So stay connected with us. Till then, happy testing. Bye-bye.